From VOA Learning English, this is the Economics Report. There are thousands of slave workers in India's western Maharashtra state. Many work over very hot stoves, making bricks from stones. Now, activists are trying to inform these workers of their basic human and economic rights. Many of the workers are landless Adivasi tribal people. They are forced into seasonal work, making bricks to pay off debt. The debts are often from borrowed money and family members who received loans and then died. Entire families may work up to 14 hours a day for low or no wages and no days off. Activists say some workers do not even know how much money they owe. Ashok Jungail is the director of a community organization near Mumbai. He says the group tells the workers they have a right to be paid and not to be abused. Jungail says the workers also have rights to take time off and to send their children to school. Most of the workers cannot read or write and keep no records. Many do not know how long they must work to repay their debt. In 2012, the Maharashtra state government appointed a committee to look for slave labor after the deaths of several workers. A spokesman for the state's labor department said it is still keeping watch for possible cases of slavery. Last month, police in Tamil Nadu rescued 564 brick workers from slavery. It was one of the largest rescue operations of workers in the country. For VOA Learning English, I'm Nikki Strong.